automated continuous exchange acclimation. Just set and walk away. These video instructions will show you how to quickly set up and acclimate using your new Reef Gently Acclimate. Nothing is easier or safer for your new aquarium inhabitant. Although the Reef Gently Acclimate is primarily designed for the reef or saltwater enthusiast, for clarity of instruction, we are demonstrating with a freshwater fish in an empty freshwater aquarium. This video will show you how to transport and acclimate your new aquarium inhabitant using your new Reef Gently Acclimate. We are showing the standard size Reef Gently Acclimate in this video, but the process is identical for the Acclimate XL, which is the larger version. The standard Reef Gently Acclimate holds a half gallon of water, whereas the XL version holds one and three quarter gallons of water. Typically, the standard unit is ideal for fish up to about two and a half inches long. Larger fish will require the Reef Gently Acclimate XL, which can safely acclimate fish up to about four inches in length. If you decide not to use the Acclimate to transport your new purchase, be sure you get enough store water in the transport bag to fill the Reef Gently Acclimate properly. Since most bags won't hold a sufficient amount of water, ask the attendant to fill a second bag with water for you to take. Slide the lid on, fasten the Velcro, and you're ready for the drive home. The Acclimate is not completely airtight to allow surface oxygenation, so it is a good idea to place a small towel on the seat or floorboard for any small spillage that may occur. Once home, take a moment to wipe off both the suction cups and the aquarium glass with a damp rag. It is very important that both the glass and the suction cups are free from dust, salt, or other debris. Then, carefully place the reef gently acclimate on your aquarium so that the water level in the acclimate lines up with the water level in your aquarium. The Reef Gently Acclimate can also be mounted inside the aquarium in a situation where acclimation rates are going to be extremely slow. And the ambient air temperature is a great deal different than the aquarium water temperature. Since this is rarely the case, an outside mountain acclimate is typically sufficient. With the acclimate mounted, simply slide the lid off, place one end of the short siphon tube into the lower metering guide, and put the other end into your aquarium, making sure it is fully submerged. Next, attach the long siphon tube to the Reef Gently Acclimate by pressing the valve barb firmly into the short tube of the Reef Gently Acclimate. The other end of the long siphon tube should hang over a large wastewater container. A five gallon bucket is usually sufficient. Since the water that flows into this container will be thrown away, the container doesn't need to be clean. Now, open the valve and start a siphon from the bottom of the long siphon tube. Once you have a steady stream, close the valve. To set the proper flow rate, insert the Ackley stick into the bottom of the long siphon tube. Use the Ackley stick guide to determine how far you insert the Ackley stick for your new inhabitant. For this video, we will insert the Ackley stick to station 13 for a semi-hardy fish. At station 13, we should be acclimating for an hour and a half, and we will have approximately two gallons of wastewater. Now, open the valve fully, and the predetermined drip rate will start flowing into your wastewater container. At this point, the water flowing is coming directly from your aquarium. Be sure not to alter or customize the length of the long siphon tube. The Ackley stick is specifically calibrated to be used with the factory tube length. To activate the continuous exchange system of the Reef Gently Acclimate, simply move the short siphon from the lower metering guide to the upper metering guide within the Reef Gently Acclimate. Congratulations! Now you're acclimating. Check your watch and come back once acclimation is complete. If you were late getting back, no problem. The acclimate just keeps doing its job, continuing to slowly exchange the water in the acclimate to the water in your tank. 
To demonstrate the continuous acclimation process, we are going to add some harmless food coloring to the water. This will allow you to see the gradual exchange of water as the acclimate does its job. As the acclimation time passes, it is easy to see the gradual exchange of the blue acclimate water with the clear aquarium water. This slow, continuous exchange of water is key to your new inhabitant's long-term health. Once acclimation is complete, remove the lid and both the long and short suction tubes. Then, slowly remove the inner tank, allowing the acclimate water to drain through its holes. With the inner tank fully drained, gently release your new resident. No net, no mess, no stress. With the automated continuous exchange system, the Reef Gently Acclimate can be used for acclimating even the most sensitive fish, corals and invertebrates, with no guesswork. It's as stress-free as acclimation can get. For more information on other uses of the Acclimate, including using our Acclimate as a fish trap, visit us at ReefGently.com. Thank you for watching.